Bright stars a little bit better and uh, take a look at what they are looking forward to the most this season. Winning. I'm looking forward to winning. I'm looking forward to discovering talents that I don't yet have and kind of just really learning something new. I feel like it's important for me to learn other dance styles and really understand it and be knowledgeable in other things than just what I've been doing. I'm looking forward to, to just making a, a great, you know, relationship and, and just winning the thing and, and having a blast. What am I looking forward to the most is probably when it's, when it's finished. That's, that's what I'm looking forward to the most, because then I go, go back to Hawaii, and I get to sit on the beach again, and then my whole family's coming back for the show, and they're gonna be in the audience as well. My four, four and a half year old boy, he's probably gonna, gonna be in there as well. Hi, Peanut! I say it means a lot, because I always wanted to do it, and I finally got the opportunity, so uh, try to make it a meaningful and get, get the win. I think the thing I'm looking forward to the most is um, just, I know I said this earlier, just stepping outside of my comfort zone. This will be a great way for me to try something different and uh, exciting. I think just getting to know my partner, Mark, I love that being able to share something with someone. I mean, competing in London with my teammates, it was, it was the best summer of my life. We're all so close, we're all best friends, so I'm excited to be able to get really close with Mark and just share this great experience with him. I'm really looking forward to pushing myself and seeing what we get. Much like I'll learn a lot about myself that I didn't perhaps know, it allowed people to know. Naps and massages and Tony saying <laughs> one more time. I just remember one, one time Chris, when Chris Yamaguchi was competing and I was recovering from breast cancer surgery and it was so inspiring for me every week to have you know, to be able to follow her and to watch her and sort of cheer her on from my bedroom. Um, and so, you know, you just never know how you're going to touch someone when you see them on television. It's an honor. It's a fabulous show. I think I'm looking forward to the challenge the most. Um, as I mentioned, dancing is not necessarily in my comfort zone, but it's a challenge that I'm willing and eager to accept. And, um, you know, it's going to be cool to know that in you know, just a few weeks, I'll be a pretty good dancer and I'll have one of the best instructors that I could ever possibly ask for. I think everybody wants to win, but it's not about that. I think it's just about the experience and also to get, you know, like some incredible dance lessons. So where else would I ever have a chance like this? And to be involved in such a kind of classy, fantastic production, really, I do feel it's an honor to be asked. You might think I'm a big old goofball or whatever you think about me, I'm in it to win it, and I'm going to take it seriously, and I'm gonna do what my dancer Sharna says. So this is very important to me. This is kind of the biggest thing I've ever done, if not the biggest thing I've ever done. This is like a big chance to dance my way into America's hearts.